1,200 of these solar panels are being installed here at the I-95 landfill complex in Lorton. It'll be Fairfax County's largest solar array. The ground that we're standing on now is actually the closed landfill part of our site. Um, it closed in 1990, uh, and we're actually standing on trash, believe it or not. Eric Forbes with the Department of Public Works and Environmental Services says instead of trash that's brought to the landfill just being covered with dirt. ReWorld is a waste to energy or energy from waste facility where they take garbage uh, from our households and from businesses. It's incinerated or burned through a furnace system that essentially goes to boilers that boil water to create steam, and then that steam generates energy that turns turbines, creating electricity that goes back to the grid for powering homes and businesses in our community. This now closed part of the landfill isn't suitable for redevelopment. There's a five megawatt solar array, about 1200 panels that will be installed over our slope here. Um, and that will generate electricity. Enough energy for a thousand homes, but this is different from a rooftop solar panel which provides electricity directly to the home it's sitting on. This facility, a uh, utility scale project, we have virtual net metering where the energy produced here will go through Dominion system and be credited back to our accounts throughout the community. So a government building in Great Falls or in Centerville could actually be using the electrons that are generated here at this site in Lorton, Virginia. The installation of this solar project will, will take us through March of 2026, but we're, we're considering full electricity being produced in spring 2026, where the green energy coming from this facility will be able to use in county buildings throughout Fairfax. In Lorton, Neil Loggenstein, WTLP News.